वेरी वॉम वेलकम टू ऑल ऑफ यू फ्रॉम गायत्री तीर्थ शांति कुंज आई हैव बीन इन टच विथ यू सिंस लास्ट अबाउट ट्वेंटी ईयर्स एंड टू द यूथ ऑफ द यू एस एंड कैनेडा सिंस लास्ट अबाउट मोर देन ट्वेल्व थर्टीन ईयर्स एंड आई हैव बीन टॉकिंग टू यू फेस टू फेस इन फ्रंट ऑफ यू बट नाउ टूडे आई एम टॉकिंग टू यू थ्रू पी डी ओ दिस इज द रीजन दैट आई हैव सेंट my representative chinmay who will be talking to you who will be solving your all problems related to the topics and various things how to unleash the human potential inside but the main thing is the harmony amongst the youngsters the harmony is something uh, which comes from uh, inside means by uh, giving up your ego giving up your uh, various uh, vices and by giving up those vices you become more closer to each other you see uh, we have come for a limited period of time there is a very limited period of time 100 years is a very limited period of time multiplied by 365 so how uh, why should we unnecessarily waste these years by unnecessarily hating each other by indulging in the jealousy indulging in the um various biases and prejudices about each other so harmony is one good quality which gurudev has suggested that try to mutually be together try to mutually be so close to each other that uh, you become uh, indispensable person to him or her uh, harmony means uh, uh, samanjasya in hindi samanjasya means means um you try to fit in like just like a block of wood fitted fits a small wood and then from all four sides it it fits in and that is how the whole building is made this particular organization which is param puja gurudev's creation uh and the whole thing like shanti kunj and dev sanskriti university and the all the shakti peet 5500 shakti peet the uh, tapo gayate tapo hume mathura and yukti tirthaval kheda dev sanskriti university and then the uh, brahmachya shoh sanstan all these are the creation of param puja gurudev by love and affection by bringing all of them together you see we had our own problems when we came i came at the age of 27 years and that was 1977 when i came to shanti kunj and there were so many senior persons to me with whom gurudev asked to sit with them he asked me to sit with them and i sat with them and i listened to gurudev's instructions but there were many things which i knew that i had not committed but gurudev is saying that you should take care of these you should take care of these you should take care of these so this means that he was telling to everybody everybody was involved in that to listen and uh, this is how we developed we evolved from 1977 to 1990 uh, all this 13 years i have observed gurudev's teaching to his to younger ones to all the disciples who have now developed as a harmonious harmonious society harmonious group of uh, a working committee harmonious group of trustees if we don't have love and affection to each other how can we uh, bring out the, bring about the conclusions how can we uh, put up our all efforts together this is what is the in a need of time today that all of us means i i when i take uh, take uh, all of us means all sects all di- all disciplines all uh, religions all groups like all genders uh, they they should all work together to bring a satyug to bring an, an era of golden age which gurudev has predicted this all will happen only when we start this experiment with ourselves my friend circle my family my larger family in which there are four or five families my organization my local organization um, chicago um, new jersey and then uh, the toronto and then the Uh, san francisco and san jose and then the la all these families they start getting united first we love each other 
we try to get involved in their in their happinesses we try to get involved in their miseries also and we try to um, get attached to each other as as much as possible this is what is the harmony harmony means uh, 1 plus 1 is equal to not 2 but 1 plus 1 is equal to 11 means you enhance the efficiency of that person you enhance the efficiency of not only that person your your efficiency also creativity also excellence also from inside this all happens when you start living um, in real sense uh, erasing your ego you see our ego is the worst enemy of ours lord krishna says in gita kaam esh krodesh rajogun samudbhav mahashano mahapapma vidhi enmi verinam in the uh, fourth chapter he says ki person should get rid of the lust the sexual the sensual desires krodh means ahamkar ego the second perverted form of the ego is anger so how to manage the anger if you are angry towards someone your colleague or your worker or your brother or your sister father mother or your teacher you immediately express it out why don't you stay silent for some time like for 5 minutes 10 minutes and then think should i express it or not you have seen the uh, modi government working modi government has recently uh, started working in india and there are so many reactions there so many things happening they are instigating him they are instigating the whole government but he and his ministry all be, the people are slowly 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 bringing the whole harmony together I, each and everybody is united each and everybody is in working in unison this is what is the difference between the previous government and this government this i am telling you because i am a very close watcher of this um, uh, modism or you can call it uh, the modi philosophy and he is a very close friend of mine uh, we have we have been talking together many times so i am just telling you the problems will be solved only by working together and working together will happen when you work in harmony working together will happen when you leave your ego uh, we we leave our ego but he doesn't leave his ego leave it to him leave it to him let 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 him express first and then you start expressing yourself this is what is the harmony and harmony when it comes it brings the constructive qualities like creativity like excellence all these things which i mentioned earlier Uh, Parampuj Gurudev used to mention in his uh, uh, one very important uh, um, form of um, message, अपने अंग व्यों से, to my parts and parcel of my uh, being. He wrote it in 1983-84, and then he said that everybody should read it once every day. We read it once every day. He said. that this yojana this yugnirman yojana this movement this this particular planning of the complete uh, consolidation of the betterment of this earth the heavenly atmosphere on this earth the humanity to be better the human beings to be divine this particular is, is not my creation it is the god's creation it is the god's given planning i am the just an uh, instrument see the humbleness of gurudev that he is saying he is doing everything he is doing everything i i presume that he is doing everything but he says i am the just nimit nimit i am just the uh, instrument in that you must have a belief a strong belief that it is it is going to happen but then he also says one thing that the one thing which you should forget is about the ahankar you should leave your ego leave your ahankar and once you leave your ego and once you leave your anger once you leave your inner in inner in negativities all those things which are harmful in, in the growth of your career they will ultimately lead you to various good things and this good thing will be a good personality emerging evolving and that good personality will make you good worker a good worker a good quality worker will only be produced only when the good qualities are earned earning the good qualities every day 
by sowing the seeds of the good qualities is culture this is culture culture brings harmony and this culture should be grown in each and every house each and every shakti peet each and every gayatri chetna kendra each and every branch of the gayatri parivar whether it is in india or whether it is abroad everywhere it is the message stands same so as we live all of us live here in together uh, around more than 4000 of us are living in the campus shanti kunj and more thousand more than 5000 are living in the university campus we 9000 people are totally living in unison in harmony and this harmony with a common kitchen with the facilities being provided by vandaniya uh, mata ji through ji ji uh, is is something which is very very unique and this particular thing unique capability of shanti kunj gayatri parivar is an example to each and every person in india if they want to make a country like this what we have here as a small model they should imitate this model this is the model we have we have made a made a model here we are taking care of our children we are taking care of our grand grandfather grandfather and all these things are being looked after by many others i am alone not responsible i am going to various programs i come to usa i go to japan i go to russia various places i taken a vacation this year from usa trip but i am telling you that whenever we go out immediately after talking to you today day after tomorrow i am leaving for varanasi for 3 days for ganga manthan for the kashi kumbh i am going there I, i will be there but someone will be here to look after all these things which are happening here so to tell you that you are not alone responsible there is a a very a big power behind you who is looking after everything and he or she uh, genderless power is genderless he or she will definitely look after you and your welfare that's why lot of people from here about more than 200 300 people at a time are out from here for 3 months 6 months and their children are being looked after by us we take we take care of them we take care of their education my two granddaughters chinmay's two granddaughters are studying in gayatri vidyapeet we take care of everybody about more than more than 1100 students are there in the gayatri vidyapeet a school from 0 to 12th Uh, that is the standard standard 12th uh, we look after each and every one nobody has to worry about anything we sit to, together and we take care of everybody this is because of the harmony amongst us which re- which is reflected in harmony in the commune and which is reflected in the harmony in the whole organization this particular ob- object should be looked after by you as you people are running this camp all of you in various groups will be discussing about the harmony harmony has to start with myself my stomach re- starts refusing to have work in harmony with uh, intestine and with an intestines refuse to work with the big larger intestine and then larger intestine they refuse to work with the liver liver starts refusing to work with the heart what will happen to the body the whole body will disintegrate this is because of harmony my body is surviving and my body is surviving because of matter and consciousness both are together para and apara these are forces are working together this is what is the importance of uh, learning the harmony you are uh, in in the illinois or you are in uh, the chicago area you are all together from various areas try to love each other try to lo- live in harmony with each other uh, emailing or various social medias all are meant for this not for the uh, spying or not for the taking out the negativity of someone but for enhancing love and affection and all these things so i hope that this camp will be a grand success for you and this camp will bring out a, unleash a very important strength of yours and that is the positivity each day start with positivity each day start with making a good friend and your friend more better more closer more harmonious to you first yourself then your own family your brother sister your mother father your grandfather and then thirdly your own friend circle and then fourthly the, the whole group together 
that is gayatri group and then with the other groups also try to merge with the other groups also swami narayan people or swadhyay people try to work with them try to play with them have a competition have a game competition with them also and um, have a picnic with them also together uh, they won't impose on you anything which is you which you don't want you won't impose anything on them let us have a love and affection amongst each other and this is how i think chicago will write a new chapter in future writing of the new usa i hope to see you in future uh, in a more harmonious and more loving way living together thank you very much for listening to me